Okay, looks like chat wants me to play some more Final Fantasy IX, so we're going to play another episode of Final Fantasy IX. Just got to get it set up for YouTube. Hey everyone, and we're back. My name is Miss Scarlet Tinnager, and we are playing some Final Fantasy IX. Let's go see what the mysterious girl whose name totally isn't Mikoto wants. Ha ha. Ha. I am so bad at not spoiling things. Oh wait, the lab is over there. Wrong way! There she is. Hi, Mikoto. I, I, I mean, girl. Oh, so that's what's going on. Gee, I should have guessed. Clones! So this is what you wanted to show me? Yes, I'm glad you understand. I don't want to understand. Sorry, but I'm not like that. Yes, you totally are. I mean, all, all, I mean, all these guys with tails who look just like me, they're a bunch of zombies. They are my peers. We are genomes. We live in this village. Genomes? Is that what they're called? Not just them, but you and me, too. It is the name of the sea given to all of us. Its name is Genome. Talk about a letdown. Who would have guessed that the home I've been yearning for was a dump like this? No wonder I never found it. It's not even on Gaia. Why are you not happy? You have returned to the place of your birth. Happy? You guys can you guys can process that emotion? Look at them! Look at all their blank faces. What can we do? After all, we are made that way. And we are built to watch over each other and work together as soulless genomes. What's it all for? Get to the point already! How come I grew up on Gaia if I was born here? I'm alive! I have a soul! Why is everyone here so... dead-faced? Because you are special. What? We are ves mere vessels. You have been given a greater purpose. The will of Garland is absolute. Garland? Who's that? Chase her! Garland watches over this planet. His mission is to restore the people of Terra. R restore the people of Terra? You mean people besides these guys here? They are merely vessels. So am I, as are you. But the true people of Terra have become asleep for ages, waiting for their time to come. When the time is right, the light of this planet will change from blue to red, and Gaia will become Terra. Wait a sec, so the people of Terra are out to take over Gaia? What else can there be? Terra has always absorbed new planets to survive. No, no, no! Duke, Duke, Genova's line isn't... Genova's only line of Final Fantasy VII is not because you are a puppet. It's be a cause you are a puppet. Like be a call sandwich. Because there is totally a typo in the game. Sorry, that's one of my favorite typos in Final Fantasy history is be a cause you are a puppet. Okay. When the time comes, the souls of the people of Terra will occupy the genomes. Such is the restoration of the people of Terra. Why do they have to be so tedious? Why don't they just wipe us out with magic like they did Alexandria? Once, Garland tried to use a more forceful method, but failed. And then he should have just quit and leave Guy alone. Because of his failure, he was forced to wait a long time. To wait until Gaia civilizations gained tremendous power. The power to use Eidolons. So that's why you attacked the Summoner's Village and destroyed Alexandria. Yep. Planets have a cycle of souls. Souls are born from the planet and then return to it. Garland planned to gain control of that very cycle. And you were supposed to help him achieve that. What? Garland is waiting for you. Come. What do you, th what do you think you're doing? I don't care about all this da Tyra, Terra and Gaia stuff. My ability to speak English is so bad. Saddam isn't even back yet. And with Dagger not feeling well, I wonder where he is. Aiko. No, Dagger, you can't get up yet. I'm alright. Listen, I want to ask you a favor. Oh, just tell me and I'll get right on it. I want you to go find Saddam. Huh? Uh oh, sure, okay. Oh, I get it. You're getting jealous. No, I'm not. I just have a feeling that something terrible is about to happen. Alright, I'll go get him. Just to stay here and rest. 
Do, 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 do. A place to call home. Oh no. <laughs> oh no, Tina! Aya, what big stone? Why you all watch stone? Is stone edible or is for barbecue? No answer. I think I lick it. You know answer, so you know mine, right? Lick! Hmm, it's very salty. Huh? Who's that? Hi, Zidane! What are you doing here, Zidane? Huh? Oh, hi, Kina. You just stand here, say nothing. Then you're just like all other dummy dummies. No one can tell difference. Wow, Kina! Way to beep! What's the word? Way to have some tact! They say someone always has double somewhere. Here there's so many of you. This world's strange place, no? Yeah, I guess. Zidon, what matter? You know seem yourself. Hmm? Oh, it's nothing. I'm always myself. Besides, it's not just me. You look just like your master, too. Of course, Master Quail is Q-Clan. We same. Yeah, I guess everybody looks the same to someone from another race. Hmm, maybe you're right. What he say? Same race? Yup! <laughs> Kina's like, wait a minute. <laughs> Even Kina has to know something's going down. Where the heart is. Excuse me. That's not Vivi's voice, that's Aiko's voice. <laughs> so, um, what do you guys do here? Dot dot dot. Zadon's Paxel has worn off. Hmm. Oh yeah, this blue light sure is pretty, isn't it? Dot dot dot. I you like it too, right? You're all looking at the blue light. The light is unpleasant to us. Uh oh, really? Huh? It's that girl. Hmm? Hi, Zadon. Hey, Zadon. What are you up to? What do you mean? What are you doing, baby? I'm trying to talk with the natives. This boy here seems to be my age and everything. You're wasting your time. They won't give you a decent answer. Oh, but I think I can get through to them. Hmm. I'm surprised you feel that way. I don't know why, but I, I feel like we're similar. Similar? What do you mean? I know they're similar to me, but... No, no not like that. They're a lot like the black mages we saw in the cargo ship, and in Clara. Of course, they don't look alike at all, but I can see one thing. Their minds aren't hollow. I think their minds are just out to lunch for a little while. Hmm, not hollow, huh? Hey, Sadon, where are you going? I just said that sentence backwards. Sadon? This is gonna be bad! Hey, Kina. Oh, Eiko, what happened to Zidane? He seem, he seem much worry. He seem much worry. Round of applause for the translations in this game. I don't know. He just left without saying a word. We go look for Zidane together. Okay. Uh-oh. Came into this world. This way. <laughs> okay. Hey, Zidane. Wait, who is that? Oh, Damarant! What do you want? What? That's no way to say hello. What the hell is this place? I thought we'd find some mean mothers down here, but they're a bunch of wimps. No challenge, huh? Zidane's got all emo like, yep, it's just downhill from here. Yeah, I guess not. Hey, Amaranth, can I ask you something? No. <laughs> no! <laughs> Do you have any parents or family? What a stupid question. Sorry, I was just curious. I don't remember any loving parents. My first memory is the face of a guy I had to fight. I only found meaning in life through combat. Funny how you put, funny how you put that in past tense. All due to my wonderful influence. <laughs> what do you want me to do? Thank you. Please, you're gonna make me sick. How about you? What? You mean my parents? Well, obviously, just look around! Everyone else should realize there's something going on between Zidane and them. I don't have parents. Yep, 
He's a clone. Cloney clone clone. Baby. Hey. <clears throat> hey, Echo. Zadon just went. You saw Zadon? Uh, yeah. Hello. Why didn't you stop him? How? Huh? How come? He was acting kind of strange. If you're gonna look for him, I'll go with you. My character voices just keep changing. They're never gonna stay the same. The truth. Hey, where are you taking me? I told you, you're going to see Garland. Yeah, of course, but this way's a dead end. There is a way. See, you may find him through the portal. Suddenly portal. He waits where the souls sleep, the floating castle, where souls bide their time until the restoration. Pandemonium. Will you not stay, say farewell to your friends? I don't care what I am. I was born here, wasn't I? If so, then I'm an enemy of the people of Gaia. You learn quickly. Make no mistake, I won't join your side. I just... If we're actually relatives, then... Yep, sisters. Brother and sister. I want to take care of this as a little family matter myself. Blood Fox, I don't do face cam when I'm recording Final Fantasy IX. That's why I don't have face cam right now. Oh, we should probably talk to Amaranth. Say, Amaranth, does the Don go this way? Yeah, seems so. He had a real serious look on his face. I knew something was wrong. Gonna go look for him, right? Huh? I'm trying to say I'll go with you. Catch my drift. Okay. Let's equip everybody. Okay, I don't care about you. I care about you. I want to give him Meteor so badly! But he's not done getting Comet! But I want to give him Meteor so badly! Fine. Well, good enough. Let's go. <laughs> hi, Mi hi, totally not Mikoto. Now you listen to me! Where'd you take Zidane? He went on his own to see Garland. Garland? Oh, that's a sinister name! But Zidane wouldn't just leave us hanging! He went, yes. He went to find out the reason for his existence. Liar! That's a terrible lie! I am an enemy of the people of Gaia, he said as he walked through the gate to Pandemonium. Well, that's bad. <laughs> I tell the others? Imagine the Final Fantasy VII Remake gets microtransactions. Do you want to buy a Phoenix Down? Only $4.99. Buy three for the price of two. That would be horrible. My favorite... I know! I know, we're getting close to my favorite part of the game, too! Yeah! So, this must be Garland's haunted mansion. Talk about bad taste in interior decorating. Alright, time to teach this tyrant a thing or two. I want to see the cross-dressing cloud parts in Final Fantasy VII in HD as well. That'd be funny. Just the entire wall market scene in HD. <laughs> Here we go. So, we meet again. Exclamation mark! Who are you? Twelve years ago, I lost one of my most prized genomes. I created him and sent him to Gaia to disrupt the cycle of souls there. You are that genome. I am glad you have returned. Shut up! Nobody tells me what to do! And I didn't come here to answer to you! Let me guess. You must be Garland. And what if I am? Then you're going down, but first you're gonna tell me everything! Like, why did I grow up on Gaia, and why do you want to destroy it? I do all these voices because I'm amazing, Fox. I have no intention of destroying Gaia. I only wish to make Gaia into Terra. What did you just say? Of course, not everything went as planned. You growing up on Gaia, for example. There is another one built as you were, 
He may be the one who threw a wrench into my gears. He? Who the heck are you talking about? Someone you know quite well. Follow me. The time when the aura of Gaia will turn into your, into the crimson glow of Terra has not yet come. I just balls up that line. <laughs> boo boo. I may need your help anyway. This is bad. Zadon, you should totally turn around right now. Go get your friends and stuff. No. No, we're not even gonna... Okay, fine. <laughs> okay, fine. Okay, fine. <laughs> Stop! Hey, old man! Knock it off. Now tell me everything! I constructed the genomes to be vessels for the souls of the people of Terra when they awaken. But 24 years ago, I gave life to a genome that was very much like you. His will was too strong to make him into a proper vessel, and I even considered discarding him. But then I put that- but then I thought that I should put his strength to use. I sent that genome as my servant to disrupt the cycle of souls on Gaia. And he blew up the summoner's village! Yeah, so tell me who he is already! Kuja, OBVIOUSLY! That's not even a spoiler at this point! Do you not, not yet know? You and he are so much alike. Alike? I've never met anyone like me! You judge only by appearances. I mean someone with a soul similar to yours. The one I sent to Gaia might also be called your brother. His name is Kuja. Kuja? He's a genome? Impossible! He doesn't even have a tail! He is only hiding it. He denies his own identity. He rejects the meaning of his existence and tries to assert his own individuality. Okay. Don't you see the resemblance? No! Zidane's <laughs> not wearing a man thong! Shut up, I'm not like him at all! Kuja's a murdering psychopath! He said the same thing when speaking about the other genomes. I'm not like these guys. Well, duh, he has a soul, the other genomes don't! That's not true! That's impossible! <laughs> His ambition was unbecoming of a genome, but it was perfect for the mission I gave him. To bring war and chaos to Gaia, that is what I sent him to do. To induce an unnaturally chaotic flow. So then why... The disruption of the flow of souls is best brought about by war. And he started a war. And what he did for me far exceeded my greatest expectations. What about me? How did I end up on Gaia? When you received the gift of life in Bran Ball, Kuja could not bear it. He could not bear to see a genome with more power than his own. He felt threatened. Kuja discarded you. He dropped you onto Gaia, the world he would destroy. So I was to be your slave just like Kuja to start a war on Gaia? Yes! Yes, you are, Zidon! That is correct. I do not expect Gaia to I did not expect Gaia! I do not expect Kuja to abandon you, but I believed it was his nature. And to him, bringing war to Gaia would prove his victory over you. Perhaps it is because of his desire to justify his existence that he let you live as well. So that is why the blood of thousands had to be spilled? Are you referring to Kuja's ambition? Or to our plan to disrupt the cycle of souls? Both! And what exactly do you gain by disrupting the cycle of souls or whatever? Well, obviously it has something to do with turning Terra into Gaia and stuff. And reasons. We must sort the souls. We- I want to disrupt Gaia's cycle, and Oh, I accidentally skipped that! Oops. To speed the cycle of souls is to speed the work as a whole, thus, war. They're trying to empty out Gaia's souls and replace them with Terra souls. That's what's happening here. That's what the line I just skipped was. And in time, Gaia's souls are gone, and Gaia becomes Terra. But how? You saw it with your own eyes. You saw the Ifa tree and the mist it emits. The role of the Ifa tree is that of the soul divider. The mist you see comprises the stagnant souls of Gaia. 
Oh yeah? But we stopped the mist so much for that! All you saw was the back of the tree. Even now, the Ifa tree blocks the flow of Gaia's souls, while it lets those of Terra flow freely. Come and see for yourself. See the true form of this planet. There are four discs in Final Fantasy IX, guys. The fourth one is pretty short. It's pretty much just the final dungeon and anywhere else you want to go. What is this? Think of it as an observatory, a place that, to measure the radiance of Gaia and Terra. What are you guys talking about? And what's this weird light? That is the center of the planet. The end and the beginning of the cycle of souls. The light remains Gaia's for now, but when the blue changes to crimson, all that will belong all will belong to Terra, and its restoration will be complete. That is why I wrapped up the light in the Aether Tree, to prevent the cycle of the judgment of souls on Gaia from inside the planet. He's, he's making no sense! Okay. Then again, I just don't like the translation of this scene. Such is the Aetha Tree's true purpose, its true form. All you saw was its material form. The flow of Gaia's souls cannot be changed simply by stopping the disposal of the mist. So Kuja is just an angel of death who sends souls to the, Aetha, to the Tree of Aetha. That's the only time it's ever been called the Tree of Aetha. What is wrong with you, Zidane? Yes, my angel of death, but only until you came of age. What do you mean? His soul is not eternal. I was going to create you next, after all. You mean, you won't need Kuja's soul once I grow stronger than him? Precisely. Soon, that time will come. Uh-oh! Well, now you should be fully aware of the meaning of your existence. Exclamation mark! Yeah, I'm aware that all the laughter, all the tears I've shared with people I grew up on Gaia... Forget all that. You are destined to live among the stars for all eternity. You have the power, the position, and the motive to do it. I wouldn't want that kind of power if only I had a place to call home. My brothers in Tantalus, Vivi, Freya, Amaranth, Kina, Steiner, Aiko, and... Dagger. My home is with them and Gaia. If you say I have a motive, then it's to punish all of you who brought pain to my friends. I'll destroy Terra. That's the reason enough for my birth here as a genome. <laughs> you tell him, Zidane! Regrettable. I thought your soul would be perfect for a new angel of death. I am the new angel of death. Yours! Don't you know what it means to meet your maker? Shut up! I've heard enough of your crap! I'm taking you out right here, right now! Foolishness. The body becomes a vessel which greets a new soul. What's happening? Yep! <laughs> and Zidane's dead. <laughs> GG, guys! GG! He's too good to make into a regular genome, but I have no choice. Well, we're just gonna have to save him. Yeah, he's gonna try to remove Zidane's soul. We have to stop this. Ugh. Oh, hi, Kuja! Oh god, now I have to do Kuja's voice. Damn it! <clears throat> I can't believe I actually returned to this place, but... Soon. Soon the power will be mine alone. <laughs> Just you wait, Garland. And you too, Zidane. I'll exact sweet revenge upon you both for insulting me. I'll make the people of both Gaia and Terra know who rules over all of them. <laughs> that laugh just gave me a stitch in my side! Ow! Ow! Muscle cramp! Muscle cramp! Ow! Pain! Make it stop! Okay, the muzzle cramp went away. Ahem. <laughs> oh, best scene in the game. Who am I? I don't know anything. I, I cannot think at all. Zidane! Yeah. I was called that once. Many people called me that. 
You always have to show off, don't you? Yeah, me I do. Why, oh, you worthless medicant! Yep, sounds about right. How very becoming of you. Becoming of me? I really learned a lot by traveling with you, Sedan. Yeah, right. I have nothing to teach. You teach me many more important things than tasty munchies. No, I don't know anything! You call that friendship? 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 Sedan? I don't know who I am. You are always there for me, Sedan. I'm so tired. How come you're always so... I am... I am an empty vessel. Sedan! Who? Wake up, Sedan! Who? Come on, Sedan, wake up! Ow! Sedan! Vivi. Aiko. Thank goodness you're alive! We thought you were dead! Oh, I... We're so... Um, we're so worried! Why did you come here all by yourself? What are you doing here? Uh-huh. We came to save you, of course. And it wasn't easy. You went off alone. Leave me alone. Huh? This has nothing to do with you. Oh, come on! Zadon's having his moment. There he goes, being the tough guy. Look, Zadon, it's not just about you. Dun, 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 dun. Come on, Zadon, don't be like that. Let's... Shut up! Shut up, you stupid brat! <laughs> Zadon, be pissed! Zadon? Oh, wrong voice. Zadon? So much synthesizer here, yep. Sadan, wait up! You need rest, Sadan! Well, you little twits, just shut up! I like angry, angry Sadan! <laughs> I, I can play this on the harp! There are some things kids can't understand. Yeah, well, you're being a douche right now, Sadan. You're being a jerk face. Let's do this. Da 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 da. Now I want to play this on my harp. Ba 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 da ba ba ba. Looks like you need some help. Hi, Freya. No, I think Zidane's pretty good. He kind of hits like a truck. <laughs> so how's my voice acting there, guys? I tried. I tried. Boof. Can't you even take care of yourself? Amaranth! Let's does this. Let's kill it in its face. Bum, ba -da -ba 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 -da -ba. Kill it in its face. We're going to kill it in its face hole. <sighs> Cause murder is fun. How foolish of you to go alone. Dot dot dot. Damn hypocrite. Always talking about friendship when you're nothing but a selfish loner. I can take care of myself. Come back, Zidon! That voice acting is great, eh? Yay! I did good! The, ch the Twitch chat said so, so it must be good. Exclamation mark! Yeah! Uh, yeah! That wasn't Kiana's voice. I will not so easily be defeated! That was not his line, either. 
Now I'm mad. I cook you good. Steiner, Kina, what are you doing? Have at thee! Taste this! Okay, another boss fight. Boss fight number two. Attack! Kill it until it dies and then kill it again. Wow. Okay, I take that back. Zidane doesn't hit like a truck. Steiner hits like a truck. Do it, Steiner, do it! Um... Ow! Okay, Kina has been relegated to the task of healer now. I'm not high enough level for this. At least not on these guys, since I never use them unless I have to. You guys... You're late, Zidon! <laughs> I love Steiner, he's so awesome. He's like, you're late! <laughs> Oh, bye, Kina. <laughs> bye, Kina! Dun 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 da da dun dun You are not alone We will stay by your side Till the end of time I guess I should revive Kina uh, he's wearing a chef's hat. Kina's wearing a chef's hat. Cool, I brought it back just in time. Can't it be both? I guess. I guess it could be both a shower cap and a chef's hat, yes. Hm! What's an unworthy opponent? Zidon, you know can leave us. I still want you to take me pastes that have lots of good food. And I have yet to conclude whether or not you are the right man for her highness, mind you. Ha! Ha ha! Good one, Cider! <laughs> Just leave me alone. I don't want to trouble you anymore. I don't think you're troubling them. Well, now it's time for the peace de resistance. You're all just a bunch of babysitting bastards. Wow, Zadon's really... Really... Really angry. But trust me, I know I'm the worst bastard here. Okay. I've gone so over time for this video, but you'd all kill me if I cut it here. Is <laughs> anything good to steal? Nope, just a phoenix down. Don't kill me! Uh, well, you kind of sucked at that shell dragon, by the way. I'm gonna hit you and your giblets. Let's get all emo up in this house, pretty much. Dun, 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 da, da, dun, dun. Come on, where's Garnet? Where is she at? Where's my girlfriend? Confirmed would kill you if you cut it here. <laughs> Zidane was a famous football player. If I remember correctly, Zidane is... His name is uh, Zindine Zidane, and he's a French football player. And by football, I think I mean soccer. But for my American viewers. Oh, bad! This is bad. That's bad. Oh! I just wasted an elixir! Oops. Dagger! Yep. Is this how you want to solve the problem? Well, I just wasted- Oh wait, no! I didn't! Good! Okay. Bahamut in the house! Ba ba da ba 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 Kill it! Kill it until it dies, then kill it some more! Oh, well, I guess I... it didn't hit Garnet at all, so... Go, Bahamut! Go! I choose you, Bahamut! 
She is stronger than Zidane! Confirmed! There's actually singing in this, huh? That's bad! Nope! I think the scene after this would have been so much better, or just even like the scene right now when Dagger comes into the fight, if she just walked over Z to Zidane and clocked him. <laughs> it's like, you're an idiot! Smack! <laughs> the women power, pretty much. Well, seeing as Garnet was the one who killed it. Oh, she learned Bahamut. Good, I can give her something else now. Dagger. You try to do everything by yourself, don't you? Try to understand. I don't want to cause trouble to anyone. Aren't we your friends? I want to think so. That's why I always... Look, I'm not from Gaia. I was just a hair's breadth away from, be from becoming the destroyer of Alexandria. I can't accept your friendship so easily. You've always protected us. But you still don't understand that we looked out for you too. You watched, we watched your back while you watched ours. And we believed in you the same way you believed in us. Just like you protected us. We want to protect you. Dagger. You say it. My master tell me, somebody give you tasties, you give them tasties too. It's good manners. I still not cook you succulent frog yet, Zidane. Kina. Chivalry requires a knight look after his comrades in arms. I shall not abandon you. And I shall follow you to kingdom come if I must. You remember that. Steiner. Ha. <laughs> what am I gonna do without you guys? Or with you guys? The feeling is mutual. <laughs> Alright, let's go. Wait. Where are the four others? Right there! <laughs> They're back that way! You don't think they've been traped? It's possible. You shouldn't have left them! That's right! I mean, really! Aww! <laughs> I'm sorry, let's head back together this time. Okay. Let's go! To infinity and beyond! The Steiner is now... Oh god. <laughs> Steiner is now uh, Buzz Lightyear confirmed. Zidane! Zidane! Why'd you leave us? I'm sorry. You're right. I need everyone's help. Don't leave us again, okay? Never. So, you had a change of heart. What a busy guy coming and going all the time. Yeah, but not anymore. We have to stop Garland. Oh yeah, that's right! Amugo followed me all the way from Bram Ball! Just tell me if you need to rest, Kubo! That was not Amugo's voice. Alright, now we can work our way out of this depressing castle. Cause we're all together now! That was not Vivi's voice at all. Uh, Cause we're all together now! And immediately changes party to my proper configuration? Um, Mognets, okay. Mog shop, anything new? Uh, buy one of those, why not? <laughs> why not? Bistro Fork, why not? I got one of those. Okay. Wait, I, did, I meant to save it. Okay, this is gonna be the end of the video for YouTube, guys. My name is Miss Scarlet Tanager, and I have been playing some Final Fantasy IX. I'll see you all in the next video.